Are asylum seekers given healthy conditions and good education in refugee camps? What is a refugee camp? According to the United Nations High Commissioner for Refugees, refugee camps are considered temporary facilities built to provide immediate protection and assistance to people who have been forced to flee due to conflict, violence or persecution. What is an asylum seeker? As the website Amnesty International says, an asylum seeker is a person who has left their country and is seeking protection in another country, but who hasn't yet been legally recognized as a refugee and is waiting to receive a decision on their asylum claim. The world's largest refugee camp is in Bangladesh, and less of 1% of refugee children living there have access to secondary education. The conditions of settlements are often very poor with deficiencies in basic supplies such as water, food, electricity, and or shelter. Seeking asylum is a human right, but most asylum seekers are not accepted into countries, therefore having to stay at a refugee camp because they cannot go back to where they came from. 70.8 million people have been displaced due to conflict, persecution or natural disasters, and there are 26 million refugees globally, being half of them children. The United Nations tries to create a safe humanitarian space in every refugee camp, which are crisis. Security. It should have a safe distance from the border, but no more than a day's walk where possible. Geography. It should have easy access to water supplies, safe geographical features, for example, stable ground soil and shaded areas, and waste management capabilities to ensure healthy and comfortable conditions. The 
layout of the site should also allow each refugee at least 480 square feet to provide dignity and mitigate the risk of health crisis. Accessibility. Humanitarian spaces require major logistics and supplies. It therefore needs to be accessible for big vehicles. Depending on the urgency of the situation, it may also require an airstrip for life-saving supplies. In the middle of a cold winter, Salim, age 2, tries to stay warm at a refugee camp near the Syrian border. With temperatures almost below zero, Salim will face the winter in a snow-covered tent with only the clothes on his back to keep him warm, reports the organization Save the Children. This is one situation in between millions of children and adults suffering. A solution would be to give refugee camps better conditions. Or if they are asylum seekers in real need for help, let them in the country and help them get a job to help not only them, but also the economy of the country.